What's going on, y'all? I want to show you a mixing vocal technique that you can use with the Denise Audio Dragonfire. And it's a technique that Andrew Sheps likes to use that would normally take a bus and send and a couple plugins to pull this off. But you can do this all inside of Dragonfire. So I've set this up without using Dragonfire. So I'm going to show you that uh, first, and then I'll show you how to do it with Dragonfire. So the technique is to send a track. In this example, I've got a vocal going to a bus. And on that bus, I've got a EQ here where I'm cutting some low mids and I'm boosting some high mids and that's followed by a LA-2A style compressor and then on a, another instance of Fat Channel I have another instance of the EQ. So what we're doing here is we're cutting some lows, boosting some highs and that signal is going to be compressed and then we're post EQing that and then blending that back in with the original vocal or track. So to do and so let's hear an example of that first. So and you would on the bus blend that back in. So this is the vocal with the EQ compression and EQ followed. And this is without the bus. Well, you gotta move slowly. Take it in my body like it's holy. And I've been waiting for you for this whole week. I've been praying for you, my son. Candy. So running through that bus is adding some presence and overall roundness and thickness that we want. But let's look at what we can do with uh, Denise Audio's Dragonfire. So for the sake of time, uh, Denise Audio has a preset that has already set this up. And it's under vocals, under push-pull trick. Or opto push-pull trick. So we select that. So you can see here we have the same thing going on here. We're cutting some lows. We're boosting some highs. And our mix is at 50% right now. So with Dragonfire, we're able to blend this just like we were doing with the fader on the bus. And the pull is set to 95%. So the pull is what helps complete this technique with Dragonfire. So with the pull all the way at zero now this boost and uh, this cut is being sent or is not being sent to the output of the compressor bringing uh, the pull in is now in going to you know depending on how much pull we bring it up to is going to introduce some of that eq curve to the signal i'm going to set this at around 75 percent and now uh, let's put the mix back to 50 and let's take a listen to this now. Well, you gotta move slowly, take it in my body like it's holy. And I've been waiting for you for this whole week. I've been praying for you, my son, day candy. And with Dragonfire Bypassed. All right, and now let's compare Dragonfire to the bust uh, that I set up here. So this is Dragonfire. Well, you gotta move slowly, take it in my body like it's holy. And I've been waiting for you for this whole week. I've been praying for you, my son, day candy. And this is with the bus. Well, you gotta move Okay, so for me, uh, Dragonfire is sounding more forward, which I like. And Dragonfire is such a versatile compressor. We can still do a lot more with this. We can add some more drive and saturation with it. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Let's turn that up to about 60. And we could even give it a softer knee here. And let's give it one more listen. 
Well, you gotta move slowly Take it in my body like it's holy And I've been waiting for you for this whole week I've been praying for you, my Sunday candy So again, we've done this with just Dragonfire No need for another bus, couple plugins. We can do this all inside Dragonfire Once again, what we're doing is cutting some lows, boosting some highs, feeding that into the compression detector circuit, and then post-EQing by applying that same curve just at a, a lesser amount post-compression. All right, and uh, if you have you know, any questions, comments, let me know. Uh, if you haven't checked out Dragonfire, I've got a link in the description for you to check it out. Again, a very, very versatile compressor plug-in. All right, I'll catch y'all next time. I want to invite you to check out my podcast, The Faders Up Podcast, where we discuss pro audio and beyond. We discuss everything from recording to gear to the music business. So if you're an audio engineer, songwriter, recording artist, music producer, this podcast is for you. We recently started season two, and we're going to have a lot of listener questions on this season, as well as some really cool guests that's lined up and giveaways as well. So if you've already subscribed and followed the podcast, thank you. If you haven't, it's available on all platforms, and I encourage you to check it out. Also, rate it and review it and let us know what you think.